Hey guys, and welcome to a brand new video. And as you see by the title of me wearing a Leeds kit, this is an Leeds United video, and it's that we have signed Cal Darlow from Newcastle United. I am so happy with this signing, and I think he'll do great. And he's our number one goalkeeper, which means Melier in the next two to three days is probably off. He's probably gone. Um, but yeah, I'm happy with Cal Darlow. People may not remember he had a season in the Premier League and did pretty well when he actually played in it. You know, um, that's one thing I want to talk about. He played in the Premier League for a season in Newcastle. I think it was Newcastle, and he did really pretty well, I think he did. And then, you know, I'm looking at Carl Darlow, and I'm looking at him as a goalkeeper. He looks like a leader on that pitch as well. That's what I want to talk about. He looks like a leader, and we need more of those. Liam Cooper's our only leader on that team, and we've, and we've entered two more in the transfer window that are both leaders, it looks like. You know, Carl Darlow, who is a leader as a goalkeeper, and, you know, Melia doesn't do much of the talking as a goalkeeper as much as Carl Darlow will. And I think Kyle Darlow as a keeper is going to instruct players where to be, like a leader should, and we need more of those on the pitch. And, of course, Ampadu does that now because we just signed him and he looks like a leader on the pitch. We need to enter some more leader-type players, and I'm so happy that we've got two new players at the club already. Um, this one we kind of already knew was going to happen a while ago. We already kind of knew Kyle Darlow was coming into Ellen Road, but now it's finally done of a fee of only 400 k He's come to Leeds for 400 k He's won the championship before, so he has championship experience and winning it. And only 400k for him? That's a bargain. And I think he'll be part of the reason we get promoted, because I believe now we're starting to make some moves and we're going to get promoted if we just start really well. Depending on how we start, I don't want to talk about that, you know, too much. But, you know, I think he's a really good goalkeeper, and I think he can do really well for us. Um, You know, I think he can... um instruct the defenders where to go in a good way and help this team. And as a goalkeeper, as a stop shotter, stop shotter, shot stopper, the other way around, shot stopper, I think he's really good. He's good with his feet, which is what we need, because Melia is kind of a bit uh, with his feet. You know, some balls go flying in the touch mostly, um, or they end up to nobody. But he's really good with his feet. He's good at stop just shot stopping, and that's what we need from him. And I'm happy that we have him on board in Ellen Road, and happy we have him at Ellen Road and at Leeds United now for this season because I believe that he's going to be a great player um, for us and one of those that will get us to the Premier League again. You know, he's had, you know, he hasn't really been at many clubs. I mean, he has been at a lot of clubs, sorry. He's been at um, Nottingham Forest. He's been at Newport County. Um, he basically just went from those two clubs for a while. He went to Walsall, um, played there for a bit. You know, went back to Forest. Forest loaned him out again to Walsall. Walsall gave him back to Forest. Forest then um, gave um, Newcastle paid five mil for him. So that's when Newcastle signed him. Then Newcastle loaned him out to Nottingham Forest again, um, and then Forest um, um, loaned him back. Um, the end of loan happened, and then they also then loaned him out again to Hull City. You know, um, and then Hull City of course loaned him back, and then now he's at Illinois. So he's been on loan a lot in his career. Um, and hasn't really been stuck at a club for, you know, a while. So I'm hoping maybe this is where he'll belong and he'll find his his form, you know. I'm happy for him to be here. The contract expires in 2026 of the three-year deal, um, which is great. It ends June 30th, 2026. He's 32 years of age. He's an older goalkeeper, which I think is what you need for a goalkeeper, an older goalkeeper that's going to lead from the back. They have a smart you know, a footballing brain because they've been in the game for a while. And I think he's going to be great for us. And he's going to be one of the, you know, I think he's going to be one of the, the reasons we get promoted because I think he's going to stop a lot of shots. And I'm hoping our defence is better with him in it. And I'm hoping we don't concede as many goals, you know. And I'm I'm praying that, yeah, he does well. He is 32 years old, we got to remember. But goalkeepers can play until they're near their 40s, you know, mid-40s, really, if they're, if they're good enough to keep up at the level. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited for him to come to the club. I hope he does well. Um, he's done a lot of, you know, in his career. What is he? He um in the championship, he played 152 games and conceded 190 goals. Um, in that season, um, he had 48 nil nil games. Um, in the Premier League, he's conceded 84 goals in 52 games with um nine nil nil games. Most of his performances, are, he's played in the championship more times than any other league. Um. By a lot, you know, he's played in the championship more than any other league, which is good. Um, because that really, the, you know, that really shows that he knows this league because he's been in it for a while. Um, and I'm excited for him to be at the club and I'm hoping he does, um, 
a good job. So, yeah, he hasn't really been... He's been in the Premier League and the Championship for a Championship for 152 matches, Premier League for 152, and that's basically... He went. To, he was in the National League for eight games, um, and, yeah, that's about it. Uh, League One, he was also only there for nine games, though. Um, so, yeah, I'm excited for him to be at this club, and I think he can be a big player for us on our way to promotion. Let's hope so. He's won the Championship before, you know. That's his only trophy. He has won the Championship um, which means let's do it again and give him his second championship. I'm happy for him to be at the club, marching on together. Let's go. Carl Darlo, welcome to Allen Road. Leads, leads, leads. Thanks for watching. If you like, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you're new. And thanks for watching. Peace.